Hey YouTube, how's it going? I uh, just wanted to uh, show you guys a thing that my wife bought. Uh, Mrs. SoCal is going to be in this video. Uh, this thing's pretty cool. It's called a tower garden. And uh, basically it's for uh, growing things in places, well, where you don't have the luxury of growing things. Like if you're in a place where you don't have a yard or uh, a balcony or something like that, you can literally put this in a window of an apartment building, say, and uh, grow a garden from it. And it's made by a company, what, Juice Plus, Juice right? Plus. Yeah, so uh, we take Juice Plus vitamins and whatnot, but by no means are we representatives or being paid. This is not a, a sponsorship thing. This is just going to be our story about the Tower Garden, see how it works. Uh, they're not cheap by any stretch, so uh, hopefully we can at least educate somebody before they go to buy it, and uh, then maybe they can learn from our experience. So anyway, we got this one assembled. It only took maybe five minutes at tops, 10 minutes maybe. Uh, it, was, it was pretty simple. Uh, basically it comes uh, with this bucket, this bucket down here, and then this lid, and this first piece is one, one piece. Uh, and then there's these sections, and they're held together with two stainless steel t tubes that uh, run up and down within them. And, uh, and then basically you just fit them together, one on top of another, top of another, top of another. Uh, and there's a water pump inside here and basically the way it works is the water pump drives water up a pipe that runs through the center of this large tube and uh, I'll show you this in a shot here uh, basically it just comes up into this bowl and spills over and drips back down through the entire system so it's basically it's like a uh, it like recycles uh, water. Yeah, it just keeps recycling water. It works sort of like hydroponics, except they call it... Uh, air, aeroponics. Aeroponics. So it's like a mixture of air and water at the same time. Supposedly, as it drips back down, it oxygenates the water, which is good for the roots. Uh, so. And the beauty of this is that you don't need soil at all. It's just basically uh, yeah. treated, treated water with a, the, the tonic... Yeah. And um, just like different fertilizers, basically. mixtures, and different fertilizers, and then you have an acid and a base uh, to treat your water in case it's off at all. Uh, and then you have a pH testing kit that it comes with as well. And then uh, yeah, exactly. There's no dirt at all. They come. It comes with like this rock wool that you plant your seeds in. And then I'm not sure exactly what this vermiculite's for. It's probably to go. To help the seeds grow. Yeah. Um, so anyway, it's just to aerate the soil. I'm, I'm imagining. So, so there's little baskets in yeah. here that you're supposed to stick in each of these little compartments. Right. And the roots are supposed to go down and then go in here somehow. Somehow, some way, they will go in there. I'm thinking. There you go. Yeah. I don't want to force it. I want to make sure I'm doing it right. But basically, you have these little pots, and they fit all the way around this thing and. Uh, look it up online, check it out. Uh, it's kind of cool to see these things working. Apparently they've got, uh, you know, these are all over the place in uh, larger cities. Uh, uh, Chicago, I think, was one of the cities that was featured on a YouTube video that I saw on it, um, where there's just rows and rows of these things that are like eight feet high, and there's restaurants grow like all their fresh vegetables out of these things in the city on rooftops. Yeah. So it's pretty cool. So um, I'm really excited about it really hope that uh, it, it works out the way it's supposed to and you just pretty much try and it should have low maintenance and you just make sure that the water is treated there's water at the bottom um, the pump is submerged correctly there's appropriate pH level yeah and yeah. Uh, you can pretty much grow anything any type of vegetable or herb or flower uh, yeah this will be sweet so yeah. Actually, one thing I want to mention uh, that I did, that I read in the instructions, and I'm always trying to tweak things and improve things. I don't know if it's going to work or not, and I'll, I'll let you know in the future, but uh, the instructions say uh, the submersible pump is basically a rectangle, and I'll, I'll show a close-up of it here. Uh, in the front of that rectangle, you can see where the, uh, there, the intake for the water is. Uh, they say just to lay it flat in the, uh, in the tub. Well, I'm not going to do it that way. I actually have it hanging. Uh, from the cord and you can see I tie a knot right here uh, basically so the pump is hanging down 
where the vent, where it intakes the water, is facing the bucket, the bottom of the, uh, the, the container. So that way it's actually closer to the bottom of the container than it would be if it was sitting flat in there. So I'll let you know how that works, but just a little modification I made right off the top. I'm, I'm always one to tweak, you know? Exactly. <laughs> so, uh, so, yeah. This is going to be a lot of fun. So, yeah, just wanted to check this out for you guys. Uh, and we'll do a series and just, uh, you know, let you know what the progress is. And, uh, yeah, it'll be tuned. fun. All right, take it easy, YouTube. Check it out. The Tower Garden. We'll let you know how we do. See ya. Bye.